So I asked in the community poll, would you guys look at the troll on any of the following Florida East Coast ES44, C4, the Norfolk Southern Gevo, the MBGA F40, or the Amtrak Viewliner, or nothing at all, but you would like a showcase anyways, and overwhelmingly over 50% voted on Florida East Coast. So that's what we're building today. We have the ES44 C4, and BNSF uses this locomotive as well. And it's different from the other Jeevos because it doesn't have a powered um, axle here in the middle. So the C stands for three axles per truck and four traction motors. So there's only two traction motors in here. If you look at this middle truck, it's missing this middle block, which you can see right there, which is on the other wheels, like in the front and the back. Uh, but yeah, this is a brand new 2021 redesign. I've just been redesigning a lot of my Jeevos if you've been watching my channel. And um, the special thing about Florida East Coast actually is that they use this in combination with the LNG uh, tenders, which are liquid natural gas, and it's an alternative to diesel fuel. It's much cleaner. And Florida East Coast, they're like the only railroad that actually uses LNG um, actively. So you can hook this up to two locomotives, one on each end, and they operate in pairs. And um, also another thing I'm doing with the Jeevos is that I'm adding this uh, loop here with the dark oak fence gate to the trucks. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the build. I hope you guys enjoy the new design. And uh, for the LNG tender, that's not quite finished yet, but maybe that's going to come in the future. Anyways, let's get started. So first off, let's grab some materials. Take out nether brick stairs, a dark oak slab, fence gate, acacia fence gate, um, black concrete. As well as an oak fence gate and oak fence. Um, let's see, oak slab and uh, polished blackstone slab. So first off in the front, we'll place down a dark oak fence gate, dark oak slab, dark oak fence gate next to it. Open that up. Behind, we'll add another brick stairs. And then another one so it's cornered, and then upside down the side, right side up here, and then upside down. Acacia stairs right in the middle. Open that up. Behind, we'll add in another brick stairs here, dark oak fence gate, and then two blocks wide black concrete. Then oak slab, we'll add in two on the diagonal here, and then another two so that they're sort of stacked on top of each other. And then on the side here, we'll add in an oak fence gate and open that up. Another oak fence gate here, open that up towards the outside, and then oak uh, fence right there. Then. Um, in the middle, we'll add in this nether brick fence, two blocks tall, chain to the side of it, and to the side of that slab like that. And we'll add in a polished blackstone slab right there in the middle. Now we'll make the trucks, so we'll place down a great terracotta, upside down, dark oak stairs, hopper, and repeat the same thing two more times. So we got all three of these wheels. Next up, we'll add in uh, nether brick stairs in the front, and that's going to be in the front of all these wheels, and then upside down next to it. And then nether brick slab in between, right in front of these hoppers here. And then in the middle, uh, let's add in nether brick slab, and we'll make that four blocks wide. And then in front of the stairs, we'll add in upside down nether brick stairs, and then a nether brick. Uh, slab you can put that at the bottom or you can make it a solid block doesn't really matter let's make it a solid block and the middle part you see it's unpowered so we don't need to add in a traction motor there then we'll add in two blocks wide another brick slab here skip a block another two and then we'll add in um an upper nether brick slab here and then another brick slab and then another brick stairs like that and then another brick wall that's going to be right above this hopper here and the other hopper here and then we'll add in a black concrete right in between here just two blocks wide and then we'll fill this all in towards the front just like that and then we'll go over here and we'll add in a two by two black concrete and then another brick slab here and then another brick stairs upside down and then a dark oak fence gate that is going to be um right at the end of the truck, open that up, and another one right over here and open it up towards, I guess, the middle. Next up, we'll add in nether brick stairs, 11 blocks long, upside down, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 
8, 9, 10, 11, and then we'll make that 2 by 2 of black concrete. Then we'll fill in the inside of this black concrete all the way across, just like that. And then we'll add in another brick slab here. All right, so next we're to copy everything that we did in the front all the way up to where we have the end of the truck here, right before the fuel tank, and we will build it on the other side right here. All right, so once we build it on the other side, it should be looking like this now. So let's go to the back first. We'll add another polished uh, blackstone slab here, oak slab next to it. And then we'll go to the back here. We'll turn this into an L shape of black concrete just to make it flat. And we will go to the front and punch out this bottom fence here, replace it with uh, another brick wall. And it's going to be the ditch lights, which is an item frame and a smooth quartz block right in front of that wall like that. And then we'll add in this L shape of yellow concrete. And then we'll add in red concrete here in the corner. And then uh, another brick slab up over there, yellow concrete on top and behind this slab. Then we'll add in two blocks wide black concrete. And then we'll add in upside down oak stairs here. Then oak stairs facing towards the corner, two of them here. Another brick slab there in the middle. Item frame here with a white bed. Black carpet on top. Blackstone bun on the side of this. Then over here, we'll add in a smooth quartz block inside like that. And a red concrete on top. Over here, we'll add in yellow concrete. And then two blocks wide, red concrete. And then red concrete here in the middle, and then make it two blocks wide and three blocks long. Then we'll add in um, yellow concrete on the inside here. Then a polished blackstone brick slab here, yellow concrete next to that. And then we'll add in two blocks wide, black glass here, red glass pane here in the middle, black glass pane next to that. Iron bar here on the side. A birch fence gate here, and acacia trap door. And open that up and open the fence gate out towards the outside and then two blocks long black concrete as well as a birch sign up over there and then three blocks wide of acacia stairs here on the side of the cab all right next we'll add in a warp slab down here and then red concrete three blocks long then go up over here in the top we'll add in snow layer two layers tall like that here in the middle of the cab and then we'll add in red concrete. We're going to make that so it's uh, six blocks long. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Then we'll add in two polished blackstone brick blocks. Then two blocks wide of acacia stairs like that. And then acacia slab here in the middle. Actually, we'll just make it an L shape like that. And then acacia fence gate there. And then a two by two acacia slabs. Then a red concrete will make it two blocks wide and three blocks long. And two blocks long polished black stone bricks. Wrap it around with red concrete. And then acacia stairs on the side, four blocks long. Then we'll move down here. We'll add in acacia trap door. And then acacia slab. And skip a block acacia stairs upside down. Then uh, over here, we'll add in red concrete. And that's going to be five blocks long, so one, two, three, four, and five. Make this part two blocks wide, and then polished black stone brick blocks inside, and then acacia slabs along the side of that. Then in the corner here, we'll add an acacia trap door, upside down, acacia stairs. And then we'll add in nether brick stairs, three blocks long here, and then another brick slab inside that gap there. Then we'll add in red concrete. On the inside of that slab, I'm going to extend this so it goes all the way to the front. Just like that. Alright, and then next up, we'll add in a red concrete right here. And then we'll add in two blocks wide red concrete. And then we'll go to the middle uh, axle here, right above this upside down. Stairs, we'll add in a um, polished black stone brick slab. Alright, and then an oak slab in the front of that. And then uh, let's go in the back. We'll add in right above this upside down stairs, polished black stone brick slab again. 
and then we'll oak slabs and we're gonna connect that to the back one and we're gonna extend it so it goes all the way across to the one in the front just like that and then next up let's go here in the back and we will add in yellow concrete just make it three blocks tall here and then red concrete here just two blocks wide on the inside part then we'll add in smooth stone slab here a birch fence gate open that up a birch button here and then an end rod top of this slab over here on top, we'll add in acacia trap doors, just five blocks long on the roof like that. And right here in the middle is going to be an iron trap door right there. All right, next we'll go over here in the back and we're going to go right behind this slab. Add in two blocks long, acacia stairs here, a red concrete, and then another acacia stairs here. Then we'll add in uh, polished blackstone brick blocks, three blocks tall like this. And then we're going to extend this all the way to the back. Then we're going to add in um, upside down oak stairs. And they're going to be right above each of these bottom stairs. And then we're going to connect them together using an acacia trap door. And the middle here we'll add a polished black stone brick block. And then a yellow concrete right there. Then we'll add in yellow concrete right here. And then red concrete two blocks tall at the bottom and we're going to extend this all the way so it goes to the back of the cab all right it should be looking like this now we're going to make this door banner go to the loom add in a black banner with red dye border put it back inside and then we're going to add in yellow dye and that's going to go on the bottom half of it and that's how you make door banner and we'll just place that in the back of the cab just like that. All right, after that, let's go in the back here. We'll add an L shape of nether brick fence. Dark oak fence here. Skip a block, two blocks tall, nether brick fence. Skip a block, and that's gonna be two blocks tall, nether brick fence. And then skip a block, nether brick fence, two blocks tall, and dark oak fence gates in between. Just like that. Alright, so after that, we're going to copy everything that we did on this side and build the other half. Once we have both halves, let's go first onto this side. And we'll add in six blocks long yellow concrete. So one, two, three, four, five, six. At the bottom of this, we'll add in red concrete. Then we'll go over here, punch in this hole here, move that red concrete in one block. Add in a polished black stone brick slab here. And then a slab on the inside of that. And then an oak slab here, and then birch slab, birch button on the side. And then red concrete in between here and over here. Now, f on top of this, we'll add in red carpet all the way across, just like that. And then we'll go on to the other side. And we'll add in a oak slab here, and then a birch slab here. And then a red wool, that's going to be two of them spaced apart like that red concrete here in the middle and then let's go back onto this side and then we'll add an acacia fence gate here open that up polish black stone brick block here skip two blocks another one here and then down here we'll add in an oak fence gate open that up acacia fence gate open that up and back here we'll add in red concrete two blocks wide here another two blocks wide here and acacia trap door right there. The other side, we'll add in a red concrete here. And then another brick slab here. Polished black stone brick block. Two red concretes. Upside down, acacia stairs, and then acacia slab. And on top of all of these parts, we'll make them red concrete. I mean, red carpets. So they match the roof. Just like that. Then we'll add in an acacia button right here. And we'll need uh, also this birch button that's going to be in this bottom corner and another one on top on the side of this PTC antenna. And then another birch button here, birch button here. There's a whole ton of birch buttons. So we'll just sprinkle them all around on top and then acacia button right there. 
notification button right here to the side. Uh, birch button here, skip block three, skip block three. And then we'll go down here, add in one more here. And then on this side, there's going to be uh, six blocks long of acacia slabs. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. And then we'll go down here, add in a wither skeleton skull. And then three nether brick slabs. One, two, three. Three upside down uh, nether brick stairs. And then a dark oak fence gate. And then three more stairs. And then over here is going to be a polished blackstone brick slab. A dark oak fence here. Another brick fence on top. Skip a block, two blocks tall, another brick fence. And then we're going to keep on doing that until we reach that uh, slab over there. And then over here in the slab, we'll add in an L shape, another brick fence. Dark oak fence there. Skip a block, two blocks tall, another brick fence. And then dark oak fence gates. That's going to be going all the way across just like this. And we'll go all the way across on this side as well. All right. Now on the other side, we'll add in uh, another brick fence here. Skip a block, another one, skip block, another one. Skip a block, another one here. And then we're gonna go dangling down, add another one here. And then two blocks all over here. On the other side, another two like that. And I think we just go every other block until we reach the back like that. And then we'll just connect them all together with dark oak fence gates. Okay, so after we've added all the fence gates, should look like this. And then we'll add in birch fence gate underneath this vent here. Open that up. And then an oak sign right underneath it. Then blackstone button, five blocks long here. Skip a block three, add another one here. Then over here, it's going to be two blocks wide yellow concrete. And then down here, it's going to be uh, red concrete. And that's going to be two blocks tall like that. And then acacia stairs here, red sandstone wall underneath it. Acacia trap door to the side, close that up. Uh, birch button here, blackstone button next to that. And then another blackstone button right underneath that part. Over here, we'll add in a birch button. And then another birch button here, another birch button down here. Birch button in front of this vent. And then over here, we'll add in a dark oak button. Birch button, acacia button on top, oak button. So many buttons here. <laughs> and then let's move um, down here. And we'll delete these bottom slabs. And we're going to make them so they're right side up. I mean, yeah, right side up. Nether brick stairs and then this one in the front is going to be facing towards it. Just like that. We'll delete this fence gate, turn it into nether brick stairs. I mean slab, right side up. And over here is going to be a nether brick stairs. So that's going to be cornered. And then nether brick stairs here. And another nether brick stairs cornered like that. And then I believe the rest of us could be nether brick slabs all the way to the end of this. Over here, we'll add in a dark oak trap door, just like that. And then dark oak fence gates three blocks long here. And we were going to open all of them up just like that. Then we're going to go on to the other side and we're going to add in blackstone button. So that's going to be three of them here. Skip a block five, one, two, three, four, five, and then another two here, and then a birch button, and then over here is going to be a yellow concrete, polished blackstone brick block, and then a red concrete underneath it, and then acacia stairs at the bottom here, acacia trap door, open that up, and then oak stairs right there, and then we're going to add in a blackstone button right there. And then we'll go down here, add a stone button, and we're gonna change this dark oak fence gate to another brick uh, fence, so it's like right up over there. So now we're gonna make these banners here in the back. So to do that, go to the loom, add in yellow banner, black dye, a row on top, put it back in, a row here in the middle, and then uh, 
we're gonna make uh I guess three copies of these banners. So we're gonna make three copies of the banner. So this regular one we can use the one we have right now. And the other one we're just gonna have in with yellow dye, and we're gonna make a diagonal cross one side. And that's gonna be on this side, and the other side we'll do I guess the other direction. So it should be like this. And we'll just put it on the other side like that. Alright, so after you've done it, that should be pretty much it on how to build the Florida East Coast ES44 C4 in Minecraft. If you guys do enjoy the video, make sure you hit that like button down below. Check out our Discord and Minecraft server. Subscribe if you had already. I'll see you guys in the next one.